In this video, we will fix msvcr120.dll is missing from your computer in Windows 10, 8 or 7. So let's begin. So to fix the error of msvcr120.dll, just go in the description and there will be a link to this page that is dll-files.com and here the heading says download msvcr120.dll. Once you land on this page, just scroll down below. And here we have to download the 32-bit version of the file as well as the 64-bit version of the file. So just go and download these both versions and you must take care that these versions must be same when you are downloading the 32-bit and the 64-bit. So just go and click on the download. First we will download the 32-bit version and the download will start in few moments. The download has started and will be finished in a few seconds. After that just go and download the 64-bit file and it will also start in few seconds. So the download of both the files is complete. Afterwards first we have to check what kind of system we have. Is it 64-bit or 32-bit? For that just go to your this PC, right click it and here click on properties. And here against the system type you can see 64-bit operating system with a 64 base processor. So we have determined that we have 64-bit operating system after that just go to your download folder and here just go and extract the 32-bit DLL files and then extract the 64-bit DLL files once we have extracted both the files first we would solve the problem for 32-bit for that just go and copy the 32-bit DLL file copy it and here just go to your this PC go to local disk C go to windows and here just scroll down below and search for system 32 here we have system 32 just go and open that and here just go and paste the 32 bit dll file click continue go back now the problem for 32 bit operating system has been solved now we will solve the problem for 64 bit operating system for that just go and copy your 64 bit operating system file copy it and here just go to your windows folder now just go and open the system32 folder and paste the 64-bit DLL file here paste it here click on continue go back now just go and copy the 32-bit DLL file again copy it and go to your windows folder and here just scroll down below and search for sys wow64 here we have sys wow64 folder just go and open that and paste the 32 bit dll file here click continue now we have solved the problem for 64 bit operating system also if you still have any confusion in where to copy where to paste just go back in this video hope the problem will be solved if you still have any confusion just comment down below i will try to answer that but before you go please subscribe like and share thank you